This is McCook's Mr. Bill. It's an honor to have you here. We got three quarters to 8,500, depending on what rain gauge you believe, close to an inch of rain last night. I was down to my last 300 gallons of water here in McCook in my barrels and tanks. Well, I'm back up to 1,100 gallons, the most I can hold. 1,100 gallons will go an awful long way for the rest of this season's growing time. My garden has been very productive, even with two hails. And it's because I save water. And it's free and a safer than groundwater. With that in mind, though, all the water that I save is still not a safe product to directly drink. Not that I'd ever want to drink it, but if I have to, I'd sure like the capabilities of drinking it. I've had only one option in that line, and that's to boil this water. Boil the water for safety. I finally spent the money, $20 bill, and I bought a life straw. $20 out of Amazon. That was including shipping. And what it is, is just a nice round tube, ultra lightweight round tube. You take the cap off here and stick that in the water or whatever source you wish to drink out of. You pull this and you drink there. This life straw will hold and be able to clean roughly 260 gallons of water. That's well over a half a year of drinking for my wife and I, if we would so desire, at a half a gallon of water a day. This is something that you want to keep in mind. Any kind of a day after scenario, whether it's local with a tornado or something, or if it got to be a major event, you're going to be on your own all too often. Now I'm not uh, the doomsdayer mindset, but at the same time this is an economical insurance policy. I have an insurance policy on my house, on my car, why not have one? And it has a five year shelf life. So what insurance policy can you spend twenty dollars on and have the capability, if you would need it, to be able to drink water safely anywhere? Now, of course, it's also transferable. If we would have to leave this area, or if this got destroyed, and we were out on our own, and no water sources, this would buy you that time. I know many government officials say that they expect the water sources to dry up and or to fail. And then the people will have to come to their centers, as they call them, and get their water. Once you enter their centers, you are not allowed to leave. That's not something you want. What you want to do is be as free as possible, and this might keep you free and safer than any government center. This is McCook's Mr. Bill saying, for a $20 bill, I hope you consider it, and I hope that uh, the rain comes your way without any hail. Rate this film. You guys have a good day.